so this is two bms combined and this is one bms so if you check this out so you can see here i have two bms what 250 amps here it is 150 150 and balance current is one amp inbuilt so this is giving you more value for money compared to when i got this this include active balancer um, wide range of strings you can use this for 4s and also 8s welcome back to the channel thanks for checking back and um, today i have something interesting for you it is the 100 balance bms okay so this is 100 balance bms and it's dali product okay so this is dali product this is like an upgraded version of the old bms now with an active balancer built in so this is one amp active balancer built in bms so you don't have to worry about re -top balancing your pack and you can always get the pack top balance this now comes with wi-fi okay so before now we used to have only bluetooth on bms but now you can see here we have wi-fi okay so this can also be monitored remotely from anywhere you are in the world so this comes with bluetooth uh, dongle okay so now the bms comes with bluetooth inbuilt so you don't have to worry about that and also we have several types of this bms we have the ones without the rs485 and can but this version is the top spec version it comes with 3.2 inch screen where you can see the soc and the battery voltage and here you can see this is also the rg485 rg45 connectors in case you want to communicate with um inverter now it comes with switch so we can also use switch to turn it off and on this is a good feature okay so we don't have to use the traditional way of using uh, um, resistance in the meter to wake the battery up or to activate the battery now you can easily use a switch to wake up your battery good one also it comes with uh these little cables uh which i may not use because i want to have my own cable length okay so this is the balance lead okay so the balance lead is also label so you can see the balance lead is label you have the temperature probe we have about two two of it and you can see this is a connector here let's see so this is connector for the b plus so the b plus now have a separate port okay so here you can see this is the separate port for the b plus so you don't get confused so here we have the balance lead and it's kind of uh, no this is not a balance lead this is the can so this is can communication you can have this pin out directly to your device okay so all this i'll be testing and this is the balance lead and temperature sensor so all this i'll be testing the communication with bms and um, the communication with inverter and all okay so this is the unboxing experience we have the service card we have the manual so on the manual you can see now that we can have the inverter um, we can have the bms in strings so you can have four to eight s strings in one bms compared to this guy that is fixed to just um eight s so here we can not only have eight s configuration and if you buy that that is it if you need a 4s you have to buy a 4s separately but now we have 8s to 4s to 8s we have 8s to 17s and we also have 8 to 24s and you can see this is the app for contact we have so many information how to connect and also what comes in the box and how the bms looks like so this is connection wiring so the wiring is very simple so i'll be showing you how to do that in the upcoming video okay so i'll be building this guys here with um the 4s to 8s configuration okay and also i'll be changing my own bms to the 150 amps configuration okay so let's see this voltages so i'm gonna take this 
I'm gonna put this on now. So I want to measure these cells now. Okay, good. So these cells have been here for almost a week now. So I've done the top balancing and they are they are sitting there. This is cell one is 3.575. Cell two 3.574 cell 3 3.573 this is cell 4 this is 3.575 what does this tell us so i charged this to 3.6 volt about a week ago so the self discharge is very very low on lithium ion phosphate battery so if you don't connect this to any source at all you will see that the self discharge rate is low and this means these are very good quality cells so i've charged them for a week now so it's holding the voltages just as if i just completed the charge okay so and you can see the voltage difference here is like 0 0.02 millivolt okay so we have about 2 millivolts on the cells this shows the quality of the cells these are itium 280 amps cells okay okay so i'll be building it with the 4s configuration and that is it subscribe to watch how i'm going to be building this battery into one unit okay so i'll be having this in it so it will also have a screen and also uh also it will come to have this as well so to have the Wi-Fi as well as communication, okay? So in case the inverter can communicate, this will also be able to communicate with the inverter. So I'll be doing this as well for my own pack because I'm replacing this older BMS because it's no longer functioning. Thank you for watching. Have a great time. <music>